Today uh, is a troubling day for taxpayers and for Canadians who are right now out of a job. The Finance Minister has confirmed that the Liberals are going to break a significant election promise and now borrow far more than the $10 billion every year to pay for their out-of-control spending. And no matter what the theatrics that they employ, they cannot blame their broken promises and runaway spending on a slowing economy. After all, they've already promised to borrow $10 billion before they even got out of the gate. And how can $10 billion not be enough? Frankly, it, br it brings into question the competence of the finance minister and the prime minister. The reality now is that it is not a time to spend. Based on slow economic growth, it's a time for the finance minister to talk about controlling spending. Ultimately, what angers you the most here? Because your message is a little unclear. Is it the spending? Is it the direction? Or, or what is it's it about? It's the lack of direction. The bottom line is that this government, whether today or in their platform, has absolutely nothing to attract business investment and bring business investment back to Canada. And that's why the economy is suffering, because we see a reduction in business investment. Businesses have lost confidence in this government. They've lost confidence in the finance minister that he actually has a plan that's business friendly and job friendly. And that's the problem. We saw today again just more dithering.